death of Ethan Winters. I wasn't able to retrieve the body, but I've recorded evidence. Share your screen, and I'll go over the situation. My team and I were careless. Yesterday, we took down the transformed Miranda, but we didn't kill her. Who knew she could fake being a corpse? <laughs> Since Miranda could have infected Ethan, I forcefully took him and Rose with us. But the vehicle they were riding in was attacked. When I got to the wreck, Ethan and Rose were gone. The last time I was able to contact Ethan, I heard Miranda's voice. She murdered him, and she is not going to get away with it. God damn it, when does it end? What's that, sir? The mission? All of it. Three years trying to put this thing in the ground. Three years too long. We'll get her, Captain. The squad's ready for you. So BSAA got here already. They didn't waste any time. Mission adjustment? No, it doesn't change anything. Terminate Miranda and rescue Rose. That's the mission. And failure's not an option. Let's have some fun, people. Like old times. Move out. Roger. Yes, sir. K9, I want to know what the hell BSAA is doing here. Find out what you can. Roger that. I'm on it. While since we fought together, Captain. When was it last? The desert? Doing nothing but recon's gotten me out of shape. But thanks to your recon, we know Miranda's plan. Couldn't quite believe it when I heard she turn herself into Mia, though. Taking five shots to the head's nothing to sneeze at, either. Spooky. Hey Alpha, look at this. BSAA, they've gone too far. Christ. It looks pretty rough down there. How are you planning on reaching the objective? First, we're gonna have to take that thing out. You got your back, boss. Let's get to work. Everyone watch for hostile bioweapons. Roger. Made contact with a group of hostile bioweapons. It's more than we thought. Watch out. Roger that. BSAA craft spotted. Two guards. <laughs> I can take them. Don't get cocky. Let's go. 
Large mutated bioweapon sighted. <laughs> Umberize, I need some backup. Target location. Damn, this is big. All right, Lobo. Marking the target. Roger that, boss. Nico, all right. Reloading now. Just a minute. This is swarm headed that way. Working? 
damn it, these things are using weapons. I'm sure they're thinking the same about you. Bioweapon numbers are increasing. We need to finish them off quick. Another hit! Ha! Ah, looks like it's about to collapse. Hold your horses. I'm reloading. It's them. Watch your horses. found a way down. I'm going in, the rest of you stay back. Captain, I compared the mold in the village with a sample from the bakers and... Uh, there's no sign of the genome editing we saw in the E-series. The stuff originated here. Megamycete, huh? Him, him, don't. Lobo, I got a tough guy here. I'm gonna need backup. Boss, you're on the ground. There's an opening in the roof. Use it. Okay, I'm moving out. Ah! 
I'll keep going. The rest of you, stay above ground. So if Miranda was the fake Mia, where's the real one? I doubt she saw any further use for her. I don't get any of this. How did Miranda even know Rose exists? A moldy little bird told her, maybe? We can figure that out later. Focus on the plan. I found it. It's the Megamycete. Alpha to squad. I've located the Megamycete. So now we can end this mess after all. About damn time. And two explosives armed. There's enough there to blow the whole village sky high. Let's get out of here and blow the damn place. Not before I end Miranda. I'm not taking any more chances. I'm going in. Roger that. Standing by. Captain, I have eyes on Miranda at the ceremony site. Keep your distance. Do not move until I give the order. I know it's too late now, but... We really should have told Ethan the plan. There wasn't time. We didn't expect Miranda to act so soon. Even so, you should have told him. Yeah. This must be Miranda's lab. So they're using this to control the bioweapons. Spencer. Here. 
No way. Show me your hands! Umbrise, this is Alpha. Where is Miranda right now? Still at the ceremony site. Whatever she's doing, she's staying put. God damn. It really is you. I'm glad you saved me. Why are you here? I was caught. In Houston experiments. Wait, did you say Mia? Mia Winters? In the flesh. What's the situation up there? Kind of a war going on. Nothing we can't handle. Don't get distracted. Stick to the mission. I'm headed to the ceremony site. Wait. You can't leave me here. You promised, damn it. You said that you would keep us safe. We did everything that you asked. We moved over here, everything. And I didn't care. So long as we were together. So you tell me, where is my husband? Where is my daughter? Ethan is gone. I couldn't save him, but I can save Rose. Come on, it's not safe here after all. What do you mean he's gone? He's dead. I'm sorry, Mia, but we have to leave. We have to destroy this village. No! You're wrong. I tried to keep this a secret, but... You don't understand how special he is. Rose. Rose. Uh. Wrong! <laughs> 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 
<laughs> it wasn't Miranda. You were always dead. What are you saying? I can still... <sighs> See? Miranda didn't kill you. You mean you didn't think it was weird? No matter how much you got hurt? Remember? No way! You shouldn't even be able to walk around. Quit messing with my head! You shouldn't be walking. Screw you! What, what am I? I... I... I did all that. <laughs> Rose. Mia. I... He awakes. Where am I? My carriage, Ethan. You were having a nightmare. Duke? Your battle with Heisenberg was a sight to see. But to think Miranda would show herself. How long have I been out? Not long till dawn. Duke, I need a favor. Take me to Miranda. I assumed as much and am already on the way. We should arrive shortly. Thank you. <laughs> but Ethan, are you sure of this? Your body is, well, falling apart. <sighs> yes. Foolish of me to ask. Speaking of foolish questions, who or what are you? <laughs> Even I can't quite answer that. We're here. I owe you one. Mr. Winters, I'm afraid you can't return to your old world any longer. Are you ready? Yeah. I have to be. I gotta go.
Out of my way. Beautiful daughter, come to me. Eva, is that you? Oh, how I've missed you! What? <laughs> My power is leaving me! Rose! Miranda! Interesting. Your body certainly is normal. Give Rose to me! Now! You will see. Once I kill you properly, everything... Get her now! Let go! I've spent a lifetime creating this moment. And you try to take it away from me. I will take what is due. My desires will be fulfilled! No! Rose is mine! What the fuck? Fulfilled your purpose, Mr. Williams. You disposed of my false children and awakened the glorious name of my seat. Now, please do not worry, the little Rose. I assure you, I'll provide her with true powers. So now you can die peacefully. You understand the level of care. Do not let him get away. How can you deny me? Why the hell can't you realize Rose is my goddamn the kid, not yours? The saved me from the pits of despair. It granted me this splendid power. Yeah, right. All it's done is drive you nuts. Will this kill you? Die! We swallowed into the Mega My Seat for all. Now, Mr. Winters, I think it's time you left things in my hands. Go on, rest now. The hell I will! I will take back my daughter! <laughs> die, 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 die! <laughs> I understand your feelings, Mr. Winters. True. But this is the end for you. If I combine Rose with a Megamycete, my daughter will be made manifest at last! I've waited a century. A century! All for this day!
Hold still. Why do you interfere? Surely you have no need of us now. So close to death. She's my goddamn daughter, you psycho! <laughs> Your life is over, Mr. Fox. Why do you stick? After all, everyone dies. I've never seen a human live without his heart. Are you sure you are one? Helen Victors, those four children, they could do nothing to assuage my years of loneliness. Ever think the problem might be you, Miranda? You're not capable of real love. I will take back my daughter! <laughs> Ethan! Ethan! Come on, Ethan. Come on, Ethan, wake up! Oh, no. Chris. Ethan. He did it. It's finished. I think we've finished each other. Ethan. We gotta move. Moving, Ethan. There's a bomb in that thing that'll blow this whole village sky high. Hey, look at me. When I hit this trigger, we can't be anywhere near it. Ah, damn it. Me is waiting for you. She's alive, you hear me? Alive. Mia. I'm so sorry. I love you. Keep Rose safe. Hey, hey. Hey. <laughs> And you tell yourself. Oh, come on, it's not that much further. What 
watch over her. Teach her to be strong. God damn it. Goodbye, Rosemary. Ethan. Take us up now! Tell me what's going on. Where? What was that? I told you to sit down. Where is he? Chris? What have you done? He's gone. He stayed so we could all escape. I'm sorry. Captain. You need to see this. BSAA didn't send soldiers. This is a bioweapon. What the hell were they thinking? Orders, Captain. Pick up the rest of the squad. Plot a course for BSAA Europe HQ. Someone's gotta pay. Thank you. 
gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more, in turn, is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Her parents, though, had searched all day and at last arrived. With rampant rage, father fought the witch, while mother's loving touch shattered the dark enchantment. But the witch was strong, and father yelled, Save our daughter! So mother bore their child to safety as the forest was consumed. Even now, the burnt forest is a grim reminder of father's sacrifice. To this day, any child who stares too long into the charred wasteland will be haunted by nightmares of getting lost while picking berries. Hello, Monty.
Do you think the little boy will be able to touch the moon? Nobody can touch the moon. It's too far away. Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Uh, okay. Then he can touch it, but it'd be very, very cold. You were being silly. I don't <laughs> think the moon feels like it. I think it does. <laughs> but it... Hey, Dad. Happy birthday. Sorry I missed last week. I have a lot of tests coming up. You know how it is. Talk of the goddamn devil. Duty calls. I love you. Yeah, I found her. Where else? The day of all days. <clears throat> we have a situation. You're needed, <laughs> Evelyn. Don't you ever call me that again. Whoa, whoa, it's just a joke, Rose. I can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. <sighs> we have a clear shot. Stand down. I can handle it. She's just a kid. <sighs> Way to keep it together, Rose. You're a lot like him, you know? I know. Like Chris, go